So I'm gonna cut my hair very short. <laughs> so bye bye long hair. <laughs> Last time seeing long hair. Last time I had short hair was like what two years ago? So I'm gonna try again. <laughs> Addiction for day of cheese, first time in our life. Look at that. And it tastes really good, yeah? Mm -hmm. But it's vegan. Dairy, lactose, and casein free, gluten soy free, cholesterol free. But it's expensive. It's like nine dollars for this. How much? 500 grams? Uh oh. 200, 202. Yeah, but it is really good, like, it's really like, it's from Canada, Vancouver, I think, and they're really stepping up the cooking. So yeah, there is no, I mean, there is excuse that money, but, you know, like, if you have the money, there is no excuse. And if you have the options, like daya cheese, like that tastes exactly the same or even better than cheese, there's no excuse to not eat vegan. Hey guys, so today we're gonna try another fruit. It's called naranjia. naranjia. And it smells like passion fruit. There's some smell that I smell before. It's Not something sure. with smelling like, like the chewing gum. tomato, arbol tomato and passion fruit. All the fruit smells the same here. <laughs> but don't buy the, don't buy the, how do you call them, mulberries here. They're really sour. So, oh. When you open it smells like kiwi. And it looks like kiwi. <laughs> it's gonna be sour. Yeah. Okay. Looks like a quinoa in there. <laughs> that is sour. Vomit fruit? No. It's not bad, but it's. It's sour. Wow. <laughs> it's worse than the passion fruit? Bad words, yeah. <laughs> Try. Yeah, it's like kiwi. It is like kiwi, like the. Mm -hmm. So sour. It's like a very unripe sour kiwi. Mm. As a. Thumbs nice down! Taste, uh, not taste, but like flavor and smell, but. Mm. Oh, mm. I bought five of them again. Nah. There's a reason why this fruit is not popular. Popular? 